coach, what's the message to the guys this week? Obviously, tough road trip, come back, but they're a resilient bunch, right? Oh, well, yeah, they're young people, and, and we still got a lot to play for. You saw we had a nice practice. We're, we're obviously hurting physically, but you know that the, they were, kids rebound. It was a tough one, but, you know, hey, we're ready to move on. You know, we have still a lot to play for. Uh, looks like Max is back. You feel like he's getting close to being 100% again? Well, we'll see. We'll see. He wanted to try it today, and, and um, we'll see. Saw him running with the ones. Is there was there any thought that maybe Ikaiko takes over at this point? No, I think Max is our starting quarterback. I thought Ikaiko did a nice job the other day, and and uh, certainly deserves a lot of credit. But Ikaiko is our starter. I mean, uh, Max is our starter. Um, offensively, you guys ran the ball really well. You feel like that's something the, the offense can build on because it feels like it opens up the passing game. As well, well, I think so. I think so. You know, I, I, we're you know we're not playing the level that we we're, we've been playing. Obviously, the good Mountain West team. We feel like we can run the ball. So yeah. Um, Nevada, what, what test do you see defensively that they're going to Well, they're, they're, they're a little bit more basic than the last couple teams we've played, but uh, they'll get after you pretty good. They're nice, sound, solid football team. They play the, they're there where they're supposed to be. And so we'll just have to see. We, can we run the ball? Can we mix it up a little bit? Um, you know, we'll find out. But they're, they're a good football team, obviously. When you go back and look at the, that last drive that ended in the missed field goal, would you guys do anything differently in terms of maybe running it on, on third down towards the middle of the field or take a delay a game to kind of push the angle back? Well, we were going to take a we were going to use a timeout prior to that, but that's that's easy to second guess. We thought you know we were trying to score a touchdown and we were just trying to do what we thought was right. We I thought we'd do, use the clock well, but you can second guess all you want. I mean, a, 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 a hash mark field goal is not all that bad. Uh, crazy road trips. I mean, you guys have gone on the road so many times and had to go back to back weeks. What do you tell the kids just to keep them focused as far as like we uh, we we always start our Thursday meetings. We put on Willie Nelson and we sing on the road again. That's what we do to have fun. I'm serious. We do it. <laughs> Moving forward, uh, how's the team's morale? And how oh, it's terrific. Why, 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 why wouldn't it be? You know, we're all disappointed, but we're not devastated. We move on. We got still have a lot to play for. We really do. And these are resilient young guys. I love these young guys. They play hard. They they understand. You know, they're all disappointed, but we, we know we have to stay together. That's the key, and, and not splinter off, and, and, and I don't think we'll do that. Breath of fresh air to kind of get the offense moving. Dylan Colley, I mean, in the passing game, they, you know, you guys really started to open it up there. Well, I think the run really helps. I think running, being able to run the ball really helps, and, uh, you know, we made some adjustments. Obviously, we Don and I talked hard last week because we hadn't been playing as well, but uh, he made some nice adjustments, and, and, it looks, oh, and hopefully we can keep that up. When you talk about being banged up defensive line wise, it looks like you're really getting hit there. Is there anything you can do, like scheme wise or anything, to, to negate that? Play with 11 DBs? I don't know. <laughs> if you got an answer, let me know about all that. I'll, I'll, I'll entertain anything you got to offer. We're ready for it. I know Nick really well, and you know I got a lot of respect for him. Uh, he's one of the, you know, outstanding young coordinators in the country right now, and uh, he does a great job with that offense. And you know they invented it there with Coach Alt and. Uh, you know, we'll be ready for him. We'll have a little something for Nick, too, so. You know, although offenses change every week, um, we pretty much stick to our rules, and the rules that we play in our defense can fit for any offense. So it's nothing different. You know, they run the split zone, zone, and they haven't run anything too much different that we haven't seen any, uh, before. It gets like Groundhog Day a little bit during the season because it's, it's the grind and without a buy and all that stuff. So a lot of it is, hey, man, you just got to keep pushing ahead. And as you get guys back, then you can get healthier, right? But the biggest thing is playing with confidence and just trying to keep stay positive about what we're doing and keep improving. I think we've done that offensively. We've improved in the last three weeks. Uh, maybe not to the result that we want in the final score, but we have improved, and that's what we want to keep doing uh, as the season wears on. You got to step up every week. You know, I know there's we losing a couple of guys, but you know it's nothing. It's, it's nothing more than that. We just got to step up to the plate and you know keep working and keep grinding and just know what we have to do in, in assignment football and discipline football. And it, this is a long season. We have six games left to play, so you know we're looking forward to it. And uh, this this next game is is a big one because it's the next one. So uh, you know we're we're looking forward to the opportunity.